These guys are saying that since we're in a church, those of you in the front row might want to choose different seating for when the lightning strikes. <laughs> As of this moment, I've uttered permaculture to 22 million people. And I've given it to them an average of eight times each. And 22 million is not enough. Damn right. <laughs> you know, Al Gore came out with that movie, An Inconvenient Truth. Mm -hmm. If you did everything Al Gore suggests, you, you know, like if everybody, everybody in the United States does everything Al Gore suggests, we have cut our carbon footprint by 22%. I'm, I want to come up with a much better recipe. I want to make it so that if 10% of the people did it, that we can have a 200% solution. Mark Twain once said that there are three kinds of lies. There's lies, damned lies, and statistics. Because <laughs> it turns out that electricity is just a small slice of the pie. Heat is more than half. People who have used a conventional wood stove and switched to a rocket mass heater have reported that they are heating their homes with one-tenth the wood. Why not take the heat from the summer and use that to heat your home through the winter? John Haight did it in Missoula. He built a couple of houses down in Missoula. Requires no heat. Just uses the, the heat from the summer to take them all the way through the winter. Very simple. Costs about the same as a conventional home. I kind of like the idea of can we come up with something that might cost a tiny fraction of a conventional home? To me, this reeks of freedom. I mean, if you, if you want to quit your wage slave job, then all you need is $15 and you can have a house. I mean, how cool is that? Slug control with a pile of rocks. Now, I don't, do you guys, yeah, what the fuck? Does this guy, how stupid does this guy think we are? Snake habitat. It's snake habitat. You're going to control slugs with a pile of rocks, and the response was, what the fuck? And, and now, now that I've pointed out that it's habitat for the snakes, well, duh. I mean, I feel like most of the stuff that I present, people are like, that's impossible, until I show a video of it, and then it's like, well, duh. <laughs> Rather than being angry at bad guys, I want to share a thousand bricks for building a better world.